Hello. I hope everybody's in uh, good spirits and uh, good life. This is a couple of wine, actually champagne bottles that I've gotten. And what I've done is I made them into a candle. First step, of course, the bottle. And what I do is I score it around here and then I pop it by running hot water, then cold, real cold. And where it's scored at, the top pops. Sometimes it won't pop in a complete circle because this is a thick glass here. But when it goes around and you see here, where it's uh, going the wrong way. All I do is I put uh, nail polish on there and that stops it from running. But as you see, I've done this one and voila. Of course, you sand down the edges on all of them because they're very sharp very sharp so as you see I seated the candle uh, the wick in the center I put some uh, super glue at the bottom and then put the wick on top of it and now I have a candle in the wine bottle and it fits just right on top of it you can see that it fits just right on top Sand it and the wick in the center and I just if I well, no, the ideal is that if I wanted to put it out I could put a top on here close this off and then I just put a top on it like that and it'll snuff out the candle then when I want to do the candle again all I do is take the top off, light the wick, and have candle lit again. Now, this one is in the beginning stage, of course. You have to cut it. And then, this is the result. See, I melt the wax inside. The wick is in the center, you can see that. You should be able to see that. Okay, and I put some little tape on the side here for the top. So it won't just fall off. But also I, I bent it back, the tape back a little bit right here. So I can pull it right off and then I just put some more tape back on. It's just a regular, regular uh, school tape. It's not no heavy duty tape because I'm going to be taking it off and putting it back on. But it's a pretty nice thick bottle and it looks nice. It's a nice look to uh, uh, a table. It's something where I have uh, um, sort of like a um, nice uh, atmosphere and I'll just bring out the, uh, the bottles and light up the candles beautiful beautiful you, you see that inside there it's the wick nice bottles they're thick they're real thick so I know they'll withstand the heat as the uh, candle melts but that's my show of uh, the garden of course as you can see here's these tomatoes very delicious tomatoes you'll pop one you'll pop one right in, in my mouth but I'm not going to do that I usually what I do with that 
because I discovered that trying to season stuff and so on and so forth and so on and so forth. What I do is I take those tomatoes and I put them in a pot and I add some water and let them steep so they get nice and soft. When they get nice and soft, then I'll go in and I'll mash them up. I'll mash them up so the, so the skin comes off. The skin is pretty tough. I was surprised. Take it and uh, and what I add is I add my favorite soup. I just did get a favorite soup. And usually they have some tomatoes in the soup anyway. But I just add the soup to the fresh, I mean these are fresh tomatoes from in the garden. As you see on my previous my previous uh, video. But that is so beautiful. And and I, I like the design of the bottles as opposed to the regular regular candles that they have. Now you see now this right here, you see that's just a regular candle. Just just look at the difference from this here and this here. Beautiful. You don't if you didn't know that that was a candle, you may even go up and try to take a drink. <laughs> but no, they're just joking. No. But that's what I've been busy doing so far. Got some other projects going on, but that's um, my candle in the bottle. I remember one time I had a, a bottle that I would put a candle on the top and as the candle drip, it would drip down the sides and they get different colors and all it would be is just colors. But now, what I'm into is flavor, so the smell. So of course, this is lavender. And I'll probably put vanilla in this one. And maybe vanilla in this one also. Love vanilla. So, that's how you do it. But let me show you the cutter. See this? This is the cutter. You place it in the hole like that. And then this is the score right here. This green thing is the score. And you just go around. You have to be very careful to keep it on the same line for it to go around. Which is probably why I got sometimes mine doesn't score right. But I've got the top off and we have candles in the bottle. Next project I might do I might do these bottles here. These bottles here, cut them off here. And then I have all this down here. And there's another plane, but still I can take this and put it on top. And I'll have the same system as this. I have a lid. And then this does have a cap to it.
cap on it like that. I can take it on and off. And of course, tape it up. I'll get this off. I'll get this off with some uh, WD-40. All this extra stuff. Yeah, it looks clear. And it looks like this. A bottle. Candle in the bottle. Thank you.